Hello guys, welcome to our YouTube channel, Login Aid. In today's video, I'm going to guide you guys on how to save your photo before your Apple deletes my photo stream. For that, make sure to watch the video till the end and you'll be able to do it in no time. First of all, tap open settings. In the settings page, you can see the first option where your name is written, tap on it. After you tap on it, you can see your Apple ID, your iCloud and many more. Tap on iCloud option iCloud storage only allows you to save 5GB of photos for free. After that, you'll have to pay in order to save photos in iCloud. In the iCloud page, tap on Photos. After you tap on it, you'll be able to see the storage that iCloud has stored your photo in. To increase the storage, you can tap on below the status option. You can see not enough iCloud storage and settings besides it. Tap on Settings. After you tap on settings, you'll be redirected to a page something like this in which you can see monthly plans and the GBs you can purchase. You can select one of the options from the list and you can tap on upgrade to iCloud in the bottom of your screen. After that, to confirm, you'll have to tap on the home button twice. Then after Apple confirms your face ID, a menu like this will pop up and you'll have to tap on continue. After that, Apple will again confirm your face ID and you'll have to type in your credit debit card information. After you're done with typing it, tap on done in the right upper corner. If you don't want to use this option, then we have another free method. So for that, go to your app store and download Google Photos if you don't have that. After you download it, tap open Google Photos. Then you'll be loaded to a page interface something like this. In this page, you can see Backup as Alexa. You'll have to tap on it to back up all your photos. After that, a menu like this will pop up on your screen and tap on Allow if you want to send notifications by Google Photos. If not, then tap Don't Allow. After that, in a few moments, you'll be redirected to a page something like this and you can see Allow Access to All Photos in the bottom of your page. Tap on it. After you're done with it, you'll be redirected to a page something like this and you'll have to tap on Photos. After you tap on it, tap on All Photos. Then go back to your Google Photos and in the Google Photos, you'll be able to see that all your Google Photos has been synced there. So that's it for the video guys. I hope the video was informative. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Till then, keep watching.